oh, uh, I don't know who's saying this. I mean, no one has accused me, I don't think. I, I'm not aware of it, of being to blame for what's going on. I do know what I have written in my book, and the book says this. Anything that happens to non-white people anywhere on this planet, during the existence of white supremacy is the fault of the white supremacists. That's a flat statement. Anything that happens to any person of color anywhere on the planet, not just in Chicago, that should not happen, the white supremacists are the usual suspects, automatically, hands down. It's always them. If you want to assess the blame, the codified uh, response, like I have in the book, is this. Many people, it's a four part, four, four parts to it, and it's in the textbook for victims of white supremacy. Many people have been harmed who should not be harmed. Okay. That's point one. Mm-hmm. Point two, many people are to blame. Point three, the people who are most to blame are hiding in plain sight. Mm-hmm. And number, number four? four, the people who are most to blame are all white supremacists. Now, that's a cliche, you might say, or a codified expression that you can apply to every situation that goes on anywhere on the planet, any time of day or night. 